I am going to be showing you how to gain money from trading and to prove my point, I will be doing a challenge to show you it works. Because using my own strategies, I will have to work all the way up from just one pair of fresh mystic pants to a full pants bundle. But for the people who are not good at trading and want a more reliable money method, I have the right thing for you at the end of this video. So the first step I'm going to take is trying to sell these fresh mystic pants for 13k gold. All right, so as you can see right here, this is my message I'm gonna use for now. I'm just gonna be swapping lobbies um, by doing slash play pit. And then just repeating the message here. Don't do this too much because you will get uh, muted if you just spam it too much. Though so sometimes they just don't read your messages in chat. So I just party them, uh, people who I think might want them and ask them if they'd like to buy them. So in this case, he has enough money to pay for these pants and it doesn't seem like he has them. Meanwhile, he's a low prestige. So this is basically perfect for what I'm trying to find. After a bit of talking, because it's very understandable that he had some questions about it as he doesn't really know about this item, I finally got him to buy them. And do remember that this is a pretty solid deal for both of us. All right, so that's a great complete. All right, so with that, I have gained some extra money. Now with this 13K, I'd like to buy some Val. Val is used a lot in trading for mystic items, so you really want it. So what we're going to go ahead and do is saying I'm buying two Val for 5,000 each. And as soon as that trade is complete, I can go over to the next step. And that is 10,000 for two Val. So the next step is gonna be two options. And either you were going to want to continue the cycle buying a fresh mystic pair right now with these two valve. And then you might say, hey, a fresh mystic pants is not worth 13k, it's actually worth 10k. Well, no, that's not the case. It's just that people like Val more than that they like gold. So if you're paying with gold, you're going to have to pay more. It's just how the economy works here. Buy the fresh mystic pants with two valve. And then again, sell the fresh mystic pants for another 13k. Unfortunately, you cannot do this on forever. As, as you can see, if I do slash trade limits in the chat, you can see I have a maximum amount of gold I can spend and a maximum amount of trades I can do in a day. Basically, this resets uh, 24 hours after your last trade. And then you're going to want to do it until you have around three or four vowels worth, because that's when you're actually going to be able to buy your first mystic item. Now the second way, and this is more a way for the prestige five and up players, is over here at the prestige shop, you can buy the first eight egg shop item with 15 renown. Again, you need to be prestige five or higher for this. As you can see, I just unlocked this. Um, that's really nice because I've been waiting to do so. Even if you're not going to be trading, this is a really good item to unlock. And now, as you can see, when I'm at the item shop, I can buy these for 200 gold each. Now I have these two Val and I spent 10k on it, meaning I should have 3000 left on my bank. So that makes up for 2000 gold, meaning I should only have 1000 gold left in my bank right now. Because definitely not everyone can buy these in the shop, because a lot of people are not Prestige 5 or just do not have them unlocked yet. What you can do is you can flip these items. And so I'm going to be selling the first 8 eggs for 400 gold each. We already got a trade request, which is perfect. Let's see, 400 gold for our first 8 egg. And as you can see, a lot of people like this deal because it's just so worth it, as it is just such a good item. Alright, so this person wants to pay a little under, which is still fine because it still profits for us. And I didn't get anything, of course, as usual. So yeah, let's get back to the challenge. This person actually wants to buy four, which is perfect. So that's going to be 1.6k, profiting me 800 gold just from this trade, which is really nice. Alright, so seems legit, and... That's a deal. All right, so this person wants to buy 10 first eight eggs, which is really nice. One vowel for 10 first eight eggs is perfect. All right, so I'm gonna trade with this person. I'm gonna put in eight eggs and I'll do the other two after this. The last two of them. Ah, look, it's one of the viewers. Yeah, if, if you see me in the game, you can always just hop by and say hi. Um, I always like interacting with you guys, so... Yeah. That person is asking me to trade them, so let's see what's on. Oh, are they just giving this for free? Oh, nice. And of course, I always take gifts from you guys. I'll never say no to that. But unfortunately, we cannot use it 
for the challenge. Wow, what a nice guy. Yeah, I. this is what I really love about the pit. Of course, there's also toxic people, but people like him make the pit a whole bunch better. All right, so we are in three Val right now, and we have around 4,000 left. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and grind just a little bit more for the 5K, and then I have four Val, and then we'll continue. After making enough money to buy my last Val up to four Val, officially doubling uh, what I started with with the challenge. All right, so after obtaining the four Val, I will now get to trading for mystic items. So our next step is basically trying to know prices on mystic items and now there's multiple ways of doing this either you join a discord and just ask around or you just ask around here in chat i also recommend you to watch some enchanting videos of just youtubers or random people and most of the time they will just keep the stuff that is worth a lot uh, and even give their prices sometimes all right so with these four val i'm just gonna go around and check on people's accounts to see if they have an item which i think is worth a little bit more than the four val to see if I can trade it so that I can then later on trade it again further until I get better and better items. All right, so the next trade I got is this four Val for this Pain Focus 3 Burst 3, which I think is a good deal as it's a pretty good sword for like starters. Um, so let's find a low prestige who might want to buy this for more. All right, so I found a buyer for this sword for six Val and that made me go from four Val to six Val already which means I'm officially one third of the way to the PB. All right, so I ended up buying uh, these two Rage Pants that are trash for four Val. Um, not using all my money at the moment, but this is still a good flip. I could probably make like a Val profit on both of these. All right, so I'm gonna sell both of them for five Val since I could not find a trade for six Val. All right, guys, I have to be honest with you. Those Rage Pants were really difficult to sell, so I would not recommend buying trash Rage Pants and trying to flip them. <laughs> That's just a quick tip right here, because it literally took me like 15 minutes to sell those. Um, anyways, we're in 7 Val right now, and uh, yeah, let's keep going. All right, so I decided to trade the 6 Val for a Makazima 3 Respawn Absorption 2, and let's see if I can flip this for some extra Val. All right, so I found this possible buyer for my uh, Makazumas. Uh, they were difficult to sell, but I got a really good price for them. We're at 9 Val right now, and I actually have an item um, that I'm trying to look out for right now, Stealth Checkouts, uh, because they often sell for more uh, than that you buy them for, if you're just uh, going to the right people. All right, so I got, um, I turned the 9 Val into 4 Fresh and 2 Val by doing some more trading. And this person um, has a pretty good trade for me right here. Um, and. I'm going to give this for self-checkout 3s, which is pretty wanted in the uh, higher play base. So yeah, I think I'm going to get a better deal out of this, making at least 2 Val, probably. Alright, so I already found a buyer for the self-checkouts for 12 Val, which is actually huge. Um, that went really fast. Uh, so apparently, uh, if you didn't know, self-checkouts are good to trade with. Yeah, so I recommend it for everyone who is doing this, as soon as you can buy self-checkouts. Uh, make sure to buy them and sell them for more. I found the person who wanted to sell me self-checkouts. These are self-checkout twos. Um, so I'm giving a little less for the life to uh, enchant ratio. All right, so this guy is the same guy as earlier who I sold the other self-checkouts to. He's just looking for them. So I'm basically sniping them and selling them to him, which is perfect. Meaning I'm already at 14 Val, so we're almost to the PB that we're looking for. Alright, so I'm again buying self-checkouts. Um, this just seems to be a really reliable method in making money. And if I were you, I would just really recommend buying self-checkouts and selling them till you have around 1 to 2 PBs worth of items. And then start doing bigger trades, because that's when you're actually going to start making money. Alright, so I found a buyer for the self-checkout 3, so this time it's a different one. And that's gonna profit again another Val. But yeah, I think we've used this method enough. We just need two more Val and then we can trade it for a PB, which is gonna be really nice and a challenge complete. All right, so this guy wants to trade two Mystic Swords for 25K, which is equivalent to five Val. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give him the cash and then I'm just gonna put away the five Val. So I just have 11 Val left. 
So I basically paid with five Val, but then I changed it into cash basically. All right, so whilst trying to sell these two mystic swords, I was able to find this guy who was willing to sell their dark pants for 25,000 or well, 20,000 and one Val. We finally got it, the last deal until I have enough. All right, and this is the final trade I'm going to be making. And that is the 18 Val that I gained from all those trades for the pants bundle as promised with this challenge to prove to you trading does work. Now I actually also have a very good trade offer just for you. So the deal is you click one time on that subscribe button and I will provide you with unlimited guides and other fun pit videos. But sometimes it is better to make money somewhere else or trading might just not be your thing. Well, ladies and gentlemen, do not worry as this video will provide you with the needed information to start making money easily without trading. Thank you for watching.